Hi, my name is Michael Gatewood, and I have an image open in Photoshop CS6, and I'd like to turn it sepia. One of the first things I'm probably going to do is go in here to Windows and Workspace and reset for my particular favorite workspace, which is photography. Let's move this Layers panel over just a bit so we can take a quick look at it. And I'm probably going to be taking a look at turning this sepia using an adjustment layer. I'm going to click, hold down, and go to something called Hue and Saturation. Going into Hue and Saturation, the Property panel will appear, which is located right here. You're also going to see a number of presets. And if you go to the presets, you'll see sepia. That is one of the easiest ways to turn an image sepia using Photoshop, keeping it in the mode RGB. Here, let's uh, zoom out just a little bit and let's apply this preset. Remember, adjustment layer, hue and saturation, and we have an adjustment layer right here. Going into the presets, going to sepia, and there we go. Now, one other adjustment that can be made, these are presets, is that we can go and move the hue slider over to give it a broad range of different kinds of color effects. And of course, going more into the default sepia, which is right in here. Remember, we can richen this and we can also lighten this just a bit by actually going into the hues and making those changes. This is one of the best options for going sepia. Now also one other option is to go to opacity and changing the opacity ever so slightly we can also start bringing back some of the original colors while still maintaining some of that sepia or that sepia feel. So in essence we have multiple effects within the preset of sepia under hue and saturation and we will find this and use this using the adjustment layer. My name is Michael Gatewood and thank you for uh, viewing.